And nothing will transform your life more than adversity. Mm. Nothing will transform your life more than a tough time, a hard place. All right? Because it is true that adversity will introduce you to yourself. Adversity will let you know what you're made of. The quote is, adversity introduces a man to himself. What are you made of? I can tell you this for a fact that I've gone through quite a few adverse situations in my life. And I am now stronger because I had to be. I am smarter because of my mistakes. I am happier because of the sadness I've experienced. And now I'm wiser because I actually learned from my adverse situations. I actually feel sorry for anybody who has never faced adversity because they, they have not had the privilege of actually knowing what they're capable of. They have not had the privilege of being introduced to the best of themselves because that is what actually brings out the best in you is hard times, adversity. You notice it doesn't say cloth or cotton uh, sharpens iron. It says iron sharpens iron, all right? Adversity is that iron. Adversity is that fire. Adversity is that tough situation that actually is necessary. And so, yes, I do feel sorry for people who have not faced adversity because adversity is actually a privilege. You are privileged to face adversity, especially early on. All right. I look, I look at adversity as a blessing in disguise. Okay. Um, even the tough situations in my life, right? I look mm -hmm. at every single tough situation, every single tough interaction, right? And even the people who have sometimes not been the best to me, right? But they have actually done the best for me. I would love to go back to them and tell them, thank you. Thank you for putting me through that. Thank you for teaching me that lesson early on because those lessons and those adversities has led to where I am today. And I don't think I would be where I am today had I not faced certain adversities. So yes, adversity is a privilege, okay? Your past is never a mistake if, if you learn from it. Your mistakes are never mistakes if you learn from them. They're lessons, all right? Um, and if you're going through an adverse situation right now, remember that it's going to be okay. But it will only be okay if you actually grow from that situation. If you actually use that situation for your benefit and not to drag yourself down about it. All right? And yes, yeah, sometimes when you go through adverse situations, it is tiring. It's exhausting. It's a lot of weight. But you know what else is tiring? Training. You know what else is exhausting? Training. You know what else is heavy? Weight training. But all those things, if you do, if you do them and you learn from them, they make you stronger, they make you better, they make you, they push you that much further ahead, all right? 2023 has been a very hard year for a lot of people. Actually, the last three years have been very hard for a lot of people. And a lot of people spend so much time feeling sorry for themselves for going through adversity as opposed to recognizing the privilege that it is to have persevered through all those hard times. If you're listening to me today, you have made it through 100% of your bad days. The only difference is, did you make it out with a lesson? Did you grow from your adversity? Did you benefit from your mistakes? Why is this is the man who profits from his mistakes? You can profit from your mistakes because all you have to do is learn the lesson and those lessons make you better. That's what adversity does, all right? Over the last three years, what have you learned? How have you grown? We talked about growth yesterday. Growth is proof of life. What have you learned? How have you improved because of the adverse situations? Or did you just come out broken and bitter? Because then you're not taking advantage of that opportunity that we talk about, all right? Like I said yesterday, 
growth is proof of life and you die a little bit every single day when you do not maximize the opportunity of life when you do not maximize the lessons of your adverse situations when you do not take advantage of those things when you go in every single day the exact same person as you went out you're dying a little bit every day but when you actually learn when you actually leverage those experiences when you actually leverage that growth you become better there's only two things that happen when you face adverse situations either you excel or you don't. And a lot of times in life it's sink or swim. And a lot of people sometimes don't even realize what they have in them until they get into that situation and that's when you see warriors come out. So if you look through your life and you see hard situations, right? Now I'm not saying that you should make your life hard but if you see hard situations, don't run from them. Because those situations will make you better. Stop seeking ease so much. Understand that adverse situations, hardship, challenges, those are a privilege, especially early on in life. If you're young, <laughs> my, my advice to you is take as many risks as you can. Educated risks, good risks, but take as many, take as many risks as you can. Go for it. If it's hard, if it's scary, yeah, definitely do that. Because you will always come out better. All right? You will always come out better. Adversity, literally, is the gas that has powered many success stories. If you look at many people who are immensely successful, you will find stories of immense adversity, a lot of failures. But it's those failures that led them to their successes. It's those failures that led them to become the people that we know about today. Not the one time they succeeded, but the 30, 50, maybe 100 times that they failed and learned. That's what adversity is, and that's why it's such a privilege. So when you see yourself right now going through an adverse situation, understand that it is actually there to make you better if you allow it. It is actually there to make you stronger if you apply it properly. It is not there to break you. It is literally there to make you, make you the best version of yourself, make you stronger, make you smarter, make you happier, and make you wiser, and therefore make you more successful at this thing we call life. So yeah, adversity is, is a privilege. Embrace it as such, and watch what happens to your life. Something to think about for Transformation Tuesday, right? <laughs> Have a fantastic day, guys. I hope, uh, like I said, I hope your day goes really well. Um, and uh, if you are going through those adverse or an adverse situation right now, change your perspective on it. You know, they say change your perspective, change your life. Change your perspective on it, all right? And understand that it is literally there to make you better. It's almost like the story I told a, a while back about the uh, um, the carrot, the egg, and coffee adversity. All right, one got hard, one got soft, and one got way more way way more beautiful and and brightened everything around them. I would not be the guy I am today had I not gone through the losses I've gone through. You know, a lot of people don't realize that. You know, I've lost both my parents. I've lost all my grandparents. Um, I've lost um, a brother, a sister. I've lost friends, you know. But every single one of those losses has made me better 
And every single one of those losses has reminded me of what I'm made of. Because despite all those losses, I continue to thrive. Despite all those losses, here I am. So what else can you throw at me? That's what adversity has given me. It's great. Adversity has given me a spine. Okay. And I hope you don't have to go through as much. <laughs> and I and trust and believe, I, I know there are a lot of people out there who've been through way more. <laughs> All right. But don't shy away from adversity. Adversity is your friend. Okay. It is there to be used and leveraged. 